Hello everyone and welcome to another Inbox Review. I am Rick Arter and today I'll be taking a look at the 125th scale Revel 1954 F1 pickup truck 2-in-1 model kit. This is a scale level 2 kit so paint and glue are required. It was released in 2011 and features 154 parts. Looking at the box art, this is typical Revel. Lots of detailed photos and information about the kit. You can see here they have it done in yellow. Some more information and features. As I stated, 154 parts, all molded in white, water slide decals, typical stuff, chrome plated parts, clear vinyl tires, and a paint guide. Similar photos on other sides. Upon opening the box, everything is nicely bagged up in individual bags, protected during shipping and storage. White molded parts bag, some chrome plated parts. You got a large bag here with all the rest of the white molded parts. You have several tires here, some small stock tires, which is nice to see they have the stock and custom here in the 2-in-1. Sometimes they won't include certain things like that, depending on what you see on the outside of the box. Clear molded parts, a chrome plated parts tree, typical recent Revell instruction manual. Here is the decal sheet. Look closer at that in a second. So open this up real quick. You can see here they have some information and features of the kit as well as some stuff before you want to start building here. Nicely detailed black and white exploded photos of assembly and painting. Very nice. On the back as always they have the decal placement final assembly. Here's the decal sheet included with the kit. Two sets of tires included with the kit. They have the low profile custom tires here and the stock tires. They include five, one for the spare, and it's the same as this one. It has the impression here for the white walls. Here's the studs for mounting the wheels to the axles. And here's the clear parts that are included with the kit. Two chrome plated parts trees included with the kit. And a quick overview of all the white molded parts included with the kit. Having the two in one, they have two sets of suspension, two sets of wheels and tires, as you saw a second ago. The only thing that I see missing is they don't include a stock engine and transmission. Well, part of an engine and transmission, I suppose. Overall though, everything looks really nice. Slight flash here and there, a little bit of mold lines, sink marks. But overall, it's a very nice looking kit. I did fit the cab and the hood section on there. It fit pretty nice, doesn't look like too much work's going to need to be done. Lots of parts in this kit for detailing. And after looking at the 1950 Ford F1 pickup 2-in-1 model kit, the only complaint I really have is that the stock engine and transmission were not included with it, but it would be easy to find one, modify it, and put it into the truck. Other than that, amazing kit. I definitely recommend it. Whether you want to build it like this, you want to kit bash it with something else, make it custom, make it off-road, whatever you want to do, this is definitely a good kit to check out. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll talk to you real soon.